What's going on? I'm taking a break from cabin building to get back to knife working. Today we're going to be working on this Bowie knife that has been clay coated. This is W2 and this stuff produces some awesome Hamon lines if you do it right. Honestly, it's, it's like flirting with disaster because to get a really vivid Hamon, you kind of need to use water and most knife makers tend to stay away from water if they can. Sometimes it causes the steel to contract too fast and harden too quickly and causes stress cracks all through it. it uh, I have a little trick that I do where I go into the water to get the initial hardening and then I go into oil to kind of hopefully relieve all that tension. The first thing I have to do is I have to get my high-tech heat treating oven ready. That's this guy. I spent so much money on this thing. I think it was like $8 at a, um, I think it was like a thrift store, right? And uh, I've been through a couple of them and so far it's it's gotten me where I needed to be. Uh, I've been through a few of them trying to find ones that, that heat evenly. And let me tell you, not all of them do. So my first thing is to set this to 400 degrees. I'm gonna let this thing warm up. And then the next step will be to heat the oil. So let's go do that now. step is we're going to go fill a bucket up with hot water. Um, I don't want to use any kind of uh, cold water. Nothing can be cold during this process because that will cause a catastrophic failure. <laughs>
don't see any cracks. I do see a Haman that's formed. You can kind of see it in there. We need to check it for hardness. Let's see. Oh yeah, you can hear that skating sound. Everything looks good. I don't see any cracks. Let's get this in the oven. I love W2. A minute ago, I was a nervous wreck, biting my fingernails, but now I feel pretty good. I feel like this is gonna look really nice. So I'm gonna let this temper for two hours. Well, I think that's it for this one. Um, I have a lot of polishing to do, and uh, I have a lot more jobs to do on this. I gotta finish polishing up the cast iron guard, and then uh, the burl has finally arrived. I will be assembling this knife in the next video, uh, knife making video that I do. Water quench and oil combination gave me a, a real fine Hamon line down the blade. Uh, I'm going to be polishing and polishing and polishing to make sure that it stands out as much as possible. So uh, stay tuned for that. Um, the next videos will probably be back out at the cabin working on it. So I'm going to be jumping back and forth just uh, making fun content. So uh, thanks for everybody who's been watching and I appreciate it. I'll see you next time.